men hating sharp words and making his heart hard will suddenly be broken and will not be made well again. When the upright have power, the people are glad. When an evil man is ruling, grief comes on the people. A man who is a lover of wisdom is a joy to his father, but he who goes in a company of loose women is a waster of wealth. A king by right rule makes the land safe, but one full of desires make it a waste. A man who says smooth things to his neighbor is stretching out a net for his steps. In the steps of an evil man there is a net for him, but the upright man gets away quickly and is glad. The upright man gives attention to the cause of the poor. The evil doer gives no thought to it. Men of pride are the cause of violent acts in a town, but by wise men wrath is turned away. If a wise man goes to law with a foolish man, he may be angry or laughing, there be no rest. Men of blood are haters of the good man, and evil doers go after his soul. A foolish man lets out all his wrath, but a wise man keeps it back quietly. If a ruler gives attention to false words, all his servants are evil doers. The poor man and his creditor come face to face. The Lord gives light to their eyes equally. The king who is a true judge in the cause of the poor will be safe forever on the seat of his power. The raw and sharp words give wisdom, but a child who is not guided is a cause of shame to his mother. When evil men are in power, wrongdoing is increased, but the upright will have pleasure when they see their downfall. Give your son training and he will give you rest. He will give the light to your soul. Where there is no vision, the people are in control. But he who keeps the law will be happy. A servant will not be trained by words. For though the sense of the words is clear to him, he will not give attention. Have you seen a man who is quick with his tongue? There is no hope for a foolish man there for him. If a servant is gently cared for from his early years, he will become a cause of sorrow in the end. An angry man is the cause of fighting, and a man given to wrath does much wrong. A man's pride will be the cause of his fall, but he who has a gentle spirit will get honor. A man who takes part with a thief has hate for his soul. He is put under oath, but says nothing. The fear of man is a cause of danger, but whoever put his faith in the Lord will have a safe place on high. The approval of a ruler is desired by great numbers, but a decision in a man's cause comes from the Lord. An evil man is disgusting to the upright, and he who is upright is disgusting to evildoers.